Hey folks, Pat Curley from LearnToGarbox.Guitar.com with a short video, basically just so I can test out some new gear. Um, the website's going great. I've had lots of people uh, using it and signing up, and it's fantastic. And some of the some of the funds that I've been able to build up from there, I've put into buying some new stuff so I can make better videos and get better products and better resources. So this little video is just to test out my new cameras and audio gear and computer and software and all the stuff that's going to make these next few lessons, and the next few courses, and all the big things that I've got planned and, uh, and ready to rock even um, more fun. Cheers. Let's rock and roll, eh? Now, the way that this particular groove works is like this. It's down really hard with the thumb on the bass on the one, on the downbeat. So the first thing you do, and then on the on the upbeat as your foot's coming back up, you really announce the groove. You announce your approach. You announce that you're here to kick some butt, right? And you do that by smacking that upbeat in perfect time, right? So and with intent, with intent, with intent, okay, like you mean it. Um, so and and the thing with that upbeat, it's not directly on the upbeat. If you're playing with a metronome, it's going to sound boring, boring, boring. Right? So when that upbeat hits slightly in advance, as if you're pushing the thing, um, you get... Yeah, so the difference between... and that... Right? It's not a shuffle that I'm playing. It's not, it's not a three feel. I'm not, um, I'm not... You know, it's still a straight feel, but I'm... I'm driving and hitting that upbeat just a little bit early to push it ahead of the beat. That's what, when you hear people say you're playing ahead of the beat, that's what it means by that, is driving that back beat there. And what happens apart from that is really down to your fingers, uh, your technical capacity. This, this lesson, uh, it, sh it should be applicable to a wide range of players. If, if your right hand's you know, strong and up to it, then you can do all sorts of fancy picking. Uh, Otherwise, just focus on that back, but that upbeat, I should say, uh, as your foot's coming up and hitting it hard and driving it hard. Listen to the great rock drummers, you know, Charlie Watts. Um, uh, listen to how that, that upbeat pushes the thing forward when they're playing this sort of style. Charlie can play back as well, of course, you know, but um, ACDC, you know, listen to how that drives Highway to Hell while bam, dup, 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 you know, pushes hard. <laughs> So that's the basic thing for, for this little lesson is, is that uh, getting that upbeat, just driving your thing. Um, I'll have a bit of a play now and just put some riffs on it. And, um, and then you go away and have a little play with it too. Okay, cheers. Enjoy. <laughs> See you soon, folks. Adios, amigos.